In response to a decision made by the Parliamentary and Health Service Ombudsman, PHSO, the administration is scheduled to release a statement this afternoon, March 25th. It made the rare but necessary decision last week to request Parliament to step in in response to grievances regarding the manner in which state pension adjustments were announced. Additionally, House of Commons leader Penny Mordaunt has received an open letter today asking MPs to vote on the compensation for women impacted by state pension changes. It has now been made public that Mel Stride, the Secretary of State for Work and Pensions, will address the House of Commons orally. Though what will be stated is unknown, there is mounting pressure on Parliament to uphold the PHSO's decision that the victims should be eligible for up to £3,000 in compensation. The dispute concerns payments to women whose retirement plans were appended by adjustments to the age at which they would be eligible for the state pension. According to the Parliamentary and Health Service Ombudsman, PHSO, last week, the victims ought to be eligible for up to £3,000 in compensation.